So for this one, we have the reduction of alkali halides to alkanes using Grignard's reagent. So we have a Grignard's reagent, and then you can have water or any acidic hydrogen source. So this will go and attack the hydrogen, right? And once it does, this is a good leaving group, so the it leaves, and it will actually form a bond with the rest of the molecule. So it will become BrMgOH. And the rest of it, right, since a hydrogen was attached, all that is left is a simple alkane, right? This was two carbons, so this is two carbons. And then the entire mechanism, if you started not with MgBr, but just with a halide, alkane, alkali um, halide, would be you add Mg and ether. Ether is just to stabilize um, the, the solution. And so you have Mg, so it'll add Mg, become this, and then you add water um, to get this mechanism where you form a alkane and then BrMgOH. So this is what um, the final uh, final thing would look like. But this is the actual mechanism where it attacks a hydrogen, forms an alkane, and the ret and Mg the the um, the electrons uh, go to Mg and then form a bond with OH to become BrMgOH. So I hope that helped and thanks for watching.